Hello extraordinary. Just wanna say Simon Sinek changed the way how most organizations and individuals operate today by writing this amazing book to start with why. So the question is how to make your why clear and it's hard even impossible that one can tell you your why. It is because your why is yours and only you can know it. But this time, understanding the golden circle may find you your true purpose, your why. This is the golden circle. Most people and organizations communicate and operate from outside in. That's why they can't maintain long-lasting success and fail. Simon Sinek says, you need to take different, even opposite approach from inside out. And this is not just opinion or our psychology, but this is our biology. If you look at a cross section of the human brain from the top down, you see the levels of the golden circle correspond precisely with three major levels of the brain. Neocortex, which corresponds with the what level, is responsible for rational and analytical thought and language, whereas the middle two sections comprise the limbic brain responsible for all human behavior and all our decision making but it has no capacity for language that's why when we have feelings for someone or we made a decision we can't verbalize why we did it and say it just feels right because limbic brain has no capacity for language this is so important to start with the why when you do it, you are directly communicating with their limbic brain which drives their decisions and emotions. This is powerful but let's clear up why, how and what. Why is just a belief, a mission of a company or any individual. That's something you are existing for. Companies are yours true purpose. How? Hows are your values or principles that guide you how to bring your cause, your purpose, your why to life. Hows are actions you take to realize that belief. What? What are the results of those actions? Everything you say and do. Your products, services, marketing, culture and whom you hire. The only way people will know what you believe is by the things you say and do. And if you are not consistent in the things you say and do, no one will know what you believe. Just want to add, your why is your life's mission. It shows the existence. Why can't be money or fame. These are results. Remember, as companies have a different why, but each one has its own, your why is one and can't be changeable. Finding your why can be difficult until you realize but if you want to change then that might be your true why which makes you inspired happy which comes from your heart not from anybody else and yeah simon snick says when writing house your values make it actionable don't write innovation write a little more innovation today if you would please or look at the problem from different angle don't write integrity, write always do the right thing. Write in verbs, don't use nouns. Remember, people don't buy what you do, they buy why you do it. If your why is not clear, nobody will ever know why does this exist. A failure to communicate why creates nothing but stress or doubt because it's at what level? The neocortex brain, rational and analytical. If this inspired you, then watch our next short video, how Orwell and Wilbur, the Wright brothers, started with why and won the battle of building the first airplane in the world. While they have no funds and no expert team, on the other hand, Samuel P. Pon Langley had everything. And yeah, subscribing the channel would be extraordinary.